requests for glute strengthening exercises. So I want to talk you through an important point. Um, there are no one and one glute strengthening exercises. I'll share some here in a minute. But if you've tried them already and they're not working for you, the key is really that you need to understand more about your pelvic floor and specifically the back of your pelvic floor. So if you're holding excessive tension in the back of your pelvic floor, you're preventing your glutes from being able to fully lengthen and shorten and you can't get stronger because you're stuck on this shorter range. And so when we try to strengthen, you're only getting a little bit and it causes you to substitute with other muscles. Or you don't include your pelvic floor in enough of your strategy. And so because you're not engaging these muscles, you're also not engaging your glutes. So this is a perfect case in point of why the same answers don't work for everybody. Because if you're someone who holds too much tension in, your, in the back of your pelvic floor, in order to turn your glutes on, you're gonna to need to learn how to relax and lengthen, and then you're gonna to need to learn to make use of that length and that full range when you're doing your strengthening exercises. Versus if you're someone who doesn't engage those muscles enough, you're gonna really wanna think about your back of your every time you're doing glute strengthening exercises. And so which can point to matters, but here is a post I did a couple of weeks ago about connecting the, uh, the diagonals, about making the opposite sides of your body work together because it can help you to engage your core and help you to find those glutes again also.